Hey everybody, MTG Orzo here, doing something not EDH. Um, I'm actually doing a draft. Um, so there's a bunch of modern flashback drafts going on right now. And we opened up... We're doing 8th edition, so uh, it's supposed to be a terrible draft format. Um, we didn't open a Blood Moon, so two best cards in the pack. Puppeteer, Pacifism. I think I'm going to take Pacifism. Um, I don't know much about this set at all. I don't actually draft very much either, but I've been reading up on this. It's something I might want to do, but I think from what I've read, uh, white is better than blue as a supporting color. I want to be in green, but you can't pass pacifism, I don't think. Um, what we got going on now? Foil Mana Clash. That's cute. Do I make this work? Look how god awful these cards are. Uh, Samite Healer. Vicious Hunger is removal. But I don't think blue black is like. Or like white black is what I want to do. Mana Clash, though. That'd be cute. Um, like, I'm not going to take Samite Healer. I'm not going to take Healing Solve. Uh, I'm not going to take Slay. Um. This is a flyer, kind of. Oh, wow, this is just terrible. I'm not going to take Grizzly Bears. Is Vicious Hunger, I mean, black seems pretty bad from what I've like researched about 8th edition. Black just seems fucking terrible. So <clears throat> I think we're going to take the Horn Claw. That seems okay to me. Wow. Oh my god. So... I don't know anything about drafting. I haven't played draft in it. I haven't drafted a set more than once since, uh, what's it called? Uh, Innistrad? Okay, so we actually, uh, we gotta do some stuff. Uh, we got some good cards in here, actually. We got some good green cards. Fortog is pretty good. Wood Elves is pretty good. So is Rampant Growth. Um,. Rampant Growth finds us a Plains. Like, if I was doing Mono Green, I'd pick Wood Elves, probably. Uh, if I have Splash Pacifism eventually, Rampant Growth is pretty good. Fortog is good. I'll probably take Fortog, because, like, so 8th Edition has, like, a bunch. It has an even spread of rares, commons, and uncommons. So you see commons all the time. You, or you see the same commons all the time, even more than a regular set. And the uncommons are very uncommon. So I think I'm going to take Fortog. We're going into three colors, but I'm probably not going to play the Horn Claw. That was just a bad pack. Fuck me, right? Okay, well, here's here's the card we're going to take. It's a 3-3 three, three for 3 Elephant. Um, This is really good. Uh, next pick would be Gravedigger. Like, I'd go into... This card's good. It's just value. Um, it's good in this format, rather. Uh... J uh, the Tome is okay. Like, if we were in big green, it's a fine, it's a playable card. Moss Monster is cute but not exciting. Like, I'll probably end up playing these because I want to be in green. I really want to be in green, so I'm going to cut off green. Um, and there is no green in this pack. Okay, Lightning Elemental is pretty good. Unsummon is playable. Redeem is okay. Mind Ben is terrible. There's a bunch of just bad, unplayable rares in 8th edition. Um, unsummon or Lightning Elemental. Do I want to get into a fourth color? Green Red it probably isn't bad. I don't know. 20 seconds left. Um, redeem or Unsummon? Unsummon's a. Yeah, I can pick up Redeem. I can pick up a Redeem later. Probably pick up on summon two. I think I'm gonna take. Uh, I'm gonna take lightning elemental. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, green's getting cut. I think. Well, no, that's a pretty late lone wolf. That's actually a pretty good card. It's better than the fucking garbage we have in the pack right now. So we're definitely green, which is where you want to be in eighth edition. You want to be in green. Um, pacifism is one of the better removal spells. Dark Banishing is the other one. It's the three mana Doom Blade. Um, but 
Pacifism was a good first pick. Uh, I think it's better than Puppeteer. It's a general rule. Okay, what do we got going on here? Nothing. I don't want to pay. I mean, this holds the ground. Holy Day is an inch, is just a fog. Fog is probably better than Canopy Spider. Canopy Spider is a dude, and we are in green. Um, I'm gonna take the green dude. Holds off flyers. The, a lot of flyers in the set are X ones. They're like one ones and two ones. So, I imagine Canopy Spider can kind of come in here and roll over some idiots. Okay, we got nothing going on here. Uh, Stone Rain is cute. I might actually take this. This is probably better than Crossbow Inventory. That does make combat difficult. But Stone Rain's a beating. Like, you can usually get these pretty late, and if you open up the Dingus Egg, it's not bad. But I have Pacifism, so I want to be in white. So I think... Is this an uncommon? No, it's common. I'm gonna take I'm gonna take the infantry. I will happily play another lone wolf. Pass them all to me. Um It's a uh three mana two two with uh Thorn Elemental ability. It's fine with me. Uh where's my Okay, I'm not gonna play this guy. He's not in my thing and I don't think I'm gonna play lightning elemental so give me a cost sort okay we have twos and threes so we need it we need to do stuff well the foil mana clash came back so I'm gonna pick that up um, without even looking at the other cards because now I have a foil mana clash and that might be the impetus I need to make a red chaos stack is because I now have a foil mana clash I did for my very first ever recorded draft Okay, now we have we have garbage. Uh, this card is a beating um, against other blue decks, but I'm not gonna be playing blue, so I'll take a sideboard mystify or demystify rather. It's not many enchantments I'd want to demystify, but there is like Phyrexian Arena in this format. A uh, Grave Pact in there too. Uh, I'll probably play a Tundra Wolves. It's a one one for one first strike. Uh, Honor Guard. Yeah, take it. Not exciting. I'll take an island <laughs> over a. Uh, uh, yeah, give, give me that. All right, next pack, pack two, pack two. So we didn't see a ton of green, but I don't know. Maybe we can just start forcing it. I do like the Foratog. It makes me happy. Okay, what did I open? Rolling Stones. See, this is what I'm talking about with shitty rares. Like, no, go to sideboard. Go to sideboard. Okay. Uh, Master Decoy seems pretty good. Uh, this is a 2-2 flyer with an upside, which is also pretty good. But I think that's better than... Like, Canopy Spider is good, but we don't want another one first pick. Shatter is terrible in this format. Uh, Drud Skeletons is actually probably pretty good if you're in black. Carrion Wall similarly deals with a lot of things, but this is fucking garbage. So is this. Revive is cute, um, but we don't have any green bombs we want to get back. I don't want a bear. I'd rather have a... Uh, I'll take the decoy. I want to see some big green stuff. Angel of Mercy, that's what I want to see. Okay, that is a that is a white card I will definitely play. It's a 3-3 three, three for 5 that gains you 3 life when you enter the battlefield. Very good. Uh, Giant Badger is also playable in the format. So is Angelic Page. Uh, Dark Banishing. Oh, Dark Banishing, what the fuck? Okay, that's that's the removal spell in this format. Do I go into black for this or splash it? Uh, I can't... But Angel... Ah, fuck. Angel of Mercy... If I had... Okay, if I had picked the... Uh, what's it called? If I picked the... Um, Rampant Growth over... I think I picked Foratog... I would take Dark Banishing because then I could grab, but this is just a, this is a beating. Like there's not many flyers that beat this. Um, but Dark Banishing, man. But Black is just so weak in this format. Yeah, I'm gonna take the Angel. Fine, that's probably wrong. Um, 
Well, fuck me, here's the fucking rampant growth, huh? Ugh. Mmm, that's annoying. I mean, do I take it now? Is it better than four? Like, what elves? What elves is a dude that gets me a land? Um. Yeah, if I'm two colors, I think I want wood elves more. I want bodies. I need big green creatures. Speaking of big green creatures, crawl worm. Uh, evacuation shouldn't be going this late. At all. This, and now, neither should this card. A Nava Shaman is good in this format. Uh, so many X ones. Uh, go away, Skype. Uh, Enrage is also pretty good, but I think we're gonna we're gonna take the big giant monster. Because uh, I was just talking about wanting big giant monsters. Alright. Um, boomerang is good. Uh, fertile ground or fertile ground. Yeah, it's ramp. But there's so much stone rain in this format. Like, I don't know how much it's worth it. But is it... Is giant badger better than ramp? I think I'd rather have another dude. Um, I just, you just need to have more bigger dudes than everybody else. Vernal Bloom, huh? Well, and Treasure Trove, Jesus. Lava Axe? Alright, this pack must have been insane. These are all very good cards in this format from what I've seen. Monstrous Growth is not bad, but we can get those later. I'm gonna play with Vernal Bloom. I'm gonna try to make this green thing work. And then we immediately get no green cards. So green is cut? I mean, I'm not splashing for that, I don't think. Yeah, like, Ruck Egg, is, is that good enough to splash for? I mean, uh, and Sandstalker is pretty great too, actually. Red is just, red is open. Red is super open. I mean, both of these cards are better than Suntail Hawk. Um, I'm going to take the egg, and I might splash it, because it does give me a 4-4 four, four flyer. I mean, it dies to unsummon. Uh, this is red's best common creature, rather. It's its best common creature. Maybe I should be in red. Okay, red seems open, because the green is sort of drying up. Uh, this isn't very good. Um, Double red, though. Seems really greedy. Double red for a 3-2 doesn't seem ideal. Maybe I just want burn? I don't know. I'm, I'm going to take the foil barbarian. I might not play it, but... Well, we we, uh, we wield revive and holy day and glory seeker, so actually white's, white's open. Uh, no one took the rolling stones. No one wants to make the wall deck. If... <laughs> uh, I mean, do I want a bear or a fog? I think in this format, I'd rather have a revive, actually. I can get more of these later, probably. I'd rather have a revive. Get back my crawl worm. Seems pretty good. Uh, I don't want another giant badger. This is a fine cyborg card, in my opinion. Peach card and oath is also a fine cyborg. Uh, I'll take a 1-1 flyer. Um, I'm not going to play this main board, so I don't think I'm going to, I might play Revive. Uh, okay, this deck is looking okay, I mean, Crawl Worm might just, Crawl Worm might just go the distance. I mean, it's a huge giant monster. Uh, none of these cards excite me. I mean, if I'm in red, you can pick up Tremors forever, so I'm just going to Forest. Whatever. You guys, red can have cards. I'll take a sh Shatter. Um, that's actually, if I, somehow, if I open Shivan Dragon and go into red, Shatter's not a bad. Okay, so, what does my deck look like with red? Because I have Lightning Elemental and Balduvian Barbarians and Ruck Egg. Maybe I Splash for the Pacifism and Angel of Mercy? That might not be the wrong play. Okay, well, we opened Wrath of God. <clears throat> well, that's far and away one of the best cards in this format. 
Uh, season Marshall is also very good, but I think we have to take the Wog. Bob Axe is pretty good, but we, we got to take Wog. Um, this is still money, and we opened another Angel of Mercy and a Rampant Growth, um, but Angel of Mercies take us to the Promised Land. This card seems very good. I mean, I am playing a deck that just wants dudes, but having this on hand, like being able to play around this seems way better than having my opponents have one. Okay, what's going on? Fungasaur. Hunted Wumpus. Griffin. Okay, this was a good pack. Fungasaur, whenever it's dealt damage, put a 1-1 one -one counter on it. Hunted Wumpus. This is 4-mana 6-6, six, six, and in this format, nothing is probably better than a 4-mana 6-6. Six, six. Is that wrong? Like, what creatures are better than a Hunted Wumpus in 8th edition? Shivan Dragon, Mahamoti Jin. I don't, I don't think there's a Sarah Angel in 8th edition. Fungasaur is cute, uh, but like I would play this if I had like the red pinging stuff. No, we're going we're gonna to take the Wumpus. I'm going to make this work. Alright, so now my, my green stuff's coming back. Nantuko Disciple is deceptively good. So is Staunch Defenders, actually. Ooh, okay. And a Foratog? Train? Okay, so... My pack one picks definitely have... Have made made me a happy man. Um, I don't want another Foratog because I'm not mono green. Disciple, though, is just... Good, but is he better? Well, I'm going to wheel something good, but I'm going to take... From what I've read, Nantuka Disciple is a card you play. Um, okay, what, what's going on? Another Balduvian Barbarians for the red we don't need. I don't need a 1-2. Uh, I might play a Fog, actually. Ooh, but a Wall of Swords... How do you how do you beat a wall of swords in this format? Yeah, how do you do it? How do you beat a wall of swords? Ivory Basque. I have Shroud. That is definitely a sideboard card that I will put in to stop the because I've been passing lava axes left and right. Um I mean, I'll play Grizzly Bear. I'll play an actual bear. Coat of Arms. Okay. Can I make Coat of Arms work? No. As much as I want to take this, I don't think I... I mean, I already have one, so I don't need another one, and it's like 15 cents. Sudden Impact's not bad. Nausea's not bad. Giant, do I need another Giant Badger? Or would I rather have a Venerable Monk? Uh, I'll take the Monk. Ooh, we got back a uh, Razorfin Griffin. Yeah, first strike flyer. I'll take it. Okay. Um, don't need any of these. This is the. These are all bad. This is the best card. I'll take that one. I'm gonna start hate drafting lava axes because I don't want to die to them. Um, I can take a Stormcrow. Just for, uh, I'll take a Thunderwolves. I could actually... I don't think I need to play it. I think I have more than enough playables. But... I'm not gonna hate draft Twiddle. What's going on? I think I'm not gonna play Rook Egg. I don't think I'm gonna play Vernal Bloom. I will grab a Holy Day, though. It's better than a Vanilla 1-2. Solidarity. I mean, I'll sideboard Solidarity. It's like Overrun, but in a Doran EDH. 
Oh, look at all this white border. This is miserable. I don't know if Fortog is good now. Because I've got enough playables, I think. Go away, Swamp. Island. Go away, Island. Alright. So, we gotta cut four cards. It seems like it shouldn't be too hard. Um, like a Tundra Wolf. Uh... I think I'm actually going to... Revive can come out. Okay. All right. Let's 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 do this. So what's going on? All right. So we got 10 minutes. Um... Foratog, I think, comes out. Yeah, I'm kind of wishing I took the Rampant Growth over Foratog. Honor Guard is the top one? Yeah. Um, one on Flyer is not interesting. One on First Striker can... That blocks Flyers. I don't know. Ah, fuck. Okay. Um, I'll take out Rushwood Dryad. No, I want dudes, though. Is, is, is Revive better than Rushwood Dryad? No, not right now. Maybe if like we go against the Dark Banishing deck... Maybe. Giant Badger good enough. I have a bunch of dudes. Lots of dudes, no combat tricks. I mean, I guess I do have Holy Day. I'm going to main deck Holy Day. Because I feel like this is a format where you can do that. Take out a Wolf. And a Badger. Because a Badger doesn't seem... No... Do I take Wall of Swords out until I see Flyers? Because now he can block stuff on the ground too, right? He's a 3-5 Flying Defender. And it's not bad. Um, hmm. This is hard because I don't draft. So I'm not sure what I should be doing. Peach Garden Oath with my 21 creatures I'm probably going to play seems pretty good. Uh, Master Decoy, tap, Honor Guard. No, I'm going to take Honor Guard out. What am I talking about? The card doesn't do anything. I thought that was the tap one, but that's Master Decoy. Uh, let's add Basic Lands. Okay, so I need to, I need to hit... Okay, so it suggests 8 and 9. So, because I have, I have all my 1 drops, half my 2 drops are white... But I need double green for this and crawl worm. Um, yeah, wood elves can find me the second forest. That seems fine. Oof. This is the deck I wanted to play though, so I'm I'm glad. Two angel mercies. Uh, I mean, I probably if I knew I was going to get another Angel of Mercy, I probably would have taken the Dark Banishing and just splashed it somehow. But Black looked pretty miserable. I'm glad we came, we could have come home with a Foil Mana Clash and a Foil Balduvian Barbarian. But this seems good. Cool. I'm going to submit this deck, and I'll see you guys in Game 1.